It is day two at Adelaide two, and our first match on court one brings together players who thrived last season. Amanda Adesimova won a title in Australia and also showed a variety by playing well on the different surfaces, making the quarterfinals at least on clay, grass, and hard courts. Brazil Salsado won three titles last season and at one stage put together a 13-match winning streak, and she enters this week playing at a career best in the rankings. Should be a good one in the welcome to court one. And uh, again, nice conditions in the Adelaide. We also have the canopy above this roof on court number one. She's coming off a very competitive match last week against Arena Salalenka. Sapsana was also a, a tough loss for her, however, she had chances, uh, especially in the first set. And as for Anna she comes into this one as a lucky loser, having uh, been beaten in the qualifying where she was. The top seed at that stage is right inside the top 25, so an extremely high cut for this event. And still a great, great feeling with some withdrawal. Camp Hunter is Jenny Dunn, except for the coin toss. This is uh, indeed a first round match in Adelaide. Adelaide 2 between Amanda Anselova and Ludmila Samsova. Anselova really tried uh, last year playing in Australia, winning that title for the uh, matchup also in play. One of the lucky losers. Like Anselova, Kaya Kamekri, she was the latest one to get it after the withdrawal of Irina Begu, the Romanian. So since uh, 21 years of age is Anastasia, the ranked number 29, dropping two spots from last week. That's uh, because she is having to defend those points as winning in uh, Melbourne. That's been as high as number 21, two career titles. The other one coming at altitude on clay courts. And speaking about Roddy for Samsonova, same for Anastasia because she won that title in Bogota, winning a hard court title as well. She has gone deep at Wimbledon on the grass. Very much an all-rounder, and that backhand, hers, especially the backhand, is uh, is stunning. She did get beaten by Veronica Pudovatova in Adelaide last week, uh, winning three games, and now it was six-three, six-love. Uh, Pudovatova, we, we know, likes to really go for those returns, be aggressive, to be able to capitalize because Anasova won less than half of her service points. Thirty-three, fourteen last season for Anasova, all matches. Besides that title in Melbourne, very well for the Australian Open, setting off match points to beat Naomi Osaka. Semi-finals in the Charleston and went deep thereafter later. Season ending for Asimova after the US Open because of a toe injury which affected her in the build-up as well as the US Open. After the US Open, just before it, well that was where Sam Sonova thrived, the 24-year-old. in Italy, formerly representing Italy, her team is still Italian. Coming in at a career best in the rankings. She was 30 and 17 last year. In her last six events, she won three of them, including two in a row, heading into the US Open, Washington and Cleveland. 
or Shaitzer, where her match against Ayla Tanyarovic and the one she lost to Sabalenka. And that one, you might recall, at the US Open, Tanyarovic, of course, the player who beat Serena at the US Open, she had a massive lead in the first set, more than a handful of set points, as we see it's the, the first meeting between these players. So that was a tough one for her to lose, but responded well in, Cle in Tokyo. Pardon me, I didn't drop a set. And that all came out, she struggled based on what she did after that, and was uh, heading into the uh, swing on the hard courts, 10 and 13. Although she did make a semi-final in Stuttgart, one of the players who was the closest to beating Ika Shiantek during her 37 match winning streak, but also was a quarterfinals in Italy last year. Pleasant conditions. One of the benefits of the playing first up at 11 a.m. 24 Celsius. It's going to go up. It's going to increase to around 30 degrees Celsius. The humidity or have been humid around 50%. shield for the players and the fans having the canopy on the center court also on court one chance to consider the edge of the win probability does Sam Sonova combination of many factors including record on this just this recent play rankings going back a few years and also head to heads which of course in this case irrelevant because it's their first matchup let's see how it does play out <laughs> 